Howard Carpenter Marmon was born in Richmond, Indiana in 1876. He obtained an engineering degree and joined the family business Nordyke & Marmon, which was the world's largest producer of machinery for flour and grain mills. Marmon designed his first automobile in 1901, and by 1904, his first production car featured such innovations as a cast aluminum body, a V4 engine, and a shaft-driven three-speed transmission. Marmon automobiles came to the forefront of public attention when one of their engineers, Ray Haroon, drove Marmons to victory at many races, including the 1909 Vanderbilt Cup and later the first Indianapolis 500-mile race in 1911. During World War I, Howard Marmon was instrumental in the design of the American Liberty aircraft engine and also consulted with Hispano Sueza in Italy, helping design their aircraft engines. Following the war, during the 1920s, Marmon automobiles were known for their technologically advanced design and superb quality. This 1926 Marmon Model D74 five-passenger sedan is a prime example of that quality. Riding on a 136-inch wheelbase, the 340 cubic inch straight-six engine developed 74 brake horsepower. This car is completely original and unrestored. The interior features wood trim and plush wool upholstery with rear window shades for added privacy. With a price tag of $3,770, equivalent to about $50,000 today, this Marmon was intentionally exclusive. Total production of all Marmon body styles was just over 3,500 cars in 1926. When the stock market crashed in 1929, Marmon saw the demand for his automobiles evaporate. Despite introducing a beautifully engineered and styled V16 automobile in 1931, it was too late. The luxury car market had virtually disappeared and the resulting few sales could not keep Marmon going. Production of Marmon automobiles ended in 1933. The company eventually merged to become Marmon Harrington, known for their heavy-duty truck and four-wheel drive components, which were also used on tanks during World War II. But they were a far cry from the beautiful cars that had been produced by Marmon. Howard Marmon died in 1943, leaving a legacy of quality engineering as still seen today in this original 1926 D-74 sedan. We thank Frederick D. Rowe for his donation of this automobile to the Classic Car Club of America Museum.